What's going on people, how are you all doing? Good evening, good afternoon, whatever time you're watching this, welcome back if you're a regular and hi if you are new to the channel. Hope you enjoy it and hope you come back and become a regular as well. Got a nice little video today coming up which explains the importance of having a filter fitted and a clean system. I think one thing everyone, regardless of your method, whether that's power flushing, fire flushing, VDI, inhibitor, whatever you do, I think we can all agree that a clean system is paramount, um, especially when fitting a new boiler. So this highlights that. Um, what else? Nothing. Installers fast approaching. You see a lot of emails and whatnot coming from manufacturers and stuff. Um, who's going? I think I'm going on Wednesday. I will have some stickers and whatnot. So, you know, if you've got a sticker wall or anything and you see me, come give me a shout, say hello. Also, just be nice to meet people in person, like speak to them in the comments and whatnot. So, yeah, be nice to meet people face to face. So let me know if you're coming in solar in the comments. Let me know your preferred method of cleaning a system and keep the questions coming in. I'm building up a little list now for the questions and answers. So drop them all in the comments and yeah, enjoy. So today we're at a Worcester 4,000, 2,000 with some hot water issues. When it was fitted, I didn't fit it. There was no filter. Um, it's had a plate from Worcester already. So I'm here descaling the plate again, fitting a filter and a scale reducer. So, yeah. So here's the boiler. So we're going to pop a scale reducer on here. Filter down here. And never actually worked on one of these. But the plate looks relatively easy to take out. So the plate's nice and easy on this, just one screw there and then it hooks in to that side. Very mucky, considering that's relatively new. some one shot bubbling away in there i will let that do its magic normally i heat it up but i will let that do its magic while it um while i fit the filter and the scale reducer Have a little check back on this. Let's go empty it out in the road. Looks cleaner inside. You can actually see the silver now. Give it another little bang out and a wash out. Give all that final muck out. And then we'll whack it back in. See so here we are, plates all in. Pressure fill back up, it's going through air purge, scale reducer and filter. So yeah, that was a nice one for a Friday morning, pretty quick and easy. Um, pressurized system was the highest point on the system, so easy to drain, 
nice lever valve for the hot water or cold water and customers happy had the boiler run in about five minutes on the hot water and didn't cut out once so let's see what's next if anything i don't know so it's not actually a job that you're going to see next it is something else that i really enjoy doing or having now that i've got instagram previously i was never really one bothered for tools but since Instagram especially, I have succumbed to a mini tool addiction. And I wanted to show this. So it's the Wera Household 2 set. And look, the really cool bit is you can get your initials on it. It's backwards, but you'll see it properly in a minute. So my wife got me this for my birthday, which I was really lucky for. And yeah, it's a really great set. I'll show you what's in there and then have a proper walkthrough in a minute. But yeah, look at all of that you get in there. So look, inside you get all the bits that you would generally use on a boiler. All your stars, torques, security heads, whatever you want to call them. Your pHs, your PZs. Little flathead there. Sockets. All the sizes. Where does it say them? From 4 mil all the way up to 13 mil. And look, they're really cool. They're not going to fall out or come out because look, they're on a twist lock system. So yeah, you have to twist that there. And you get a mini ratchet, but look how cool this is. Initials on it. Little electrical screwdriver where you've got all the little bits here. Again, these are little tiny ones. These are really good for terminals. And screwdriver handle. And again, if I can get it out, initials on there. So, and then yeah, on the main face plate is on there and you can have whatever you want. So I love this little set. It's actually my first wearer set. And it's actually my first wearer set of tools at all. I think I had a little flathead. Well, yeah, I did have a little three and a half mil flathead and that was it. Um, and to be honest, I can 100% see the appeal for them now after having this it's actually really cheap it's um pretty sure it's like 60 pounds for this set and it's got a velcro patch on the back so you can velcro it to i don't know tool bags or whatever and yeah just really really useful set that i love to be honest um it's got the little socket adapter there so you can put sockets on the driver as well and the best thing other than the engraving the rj heating brand colors so yeah that's another little win too so yeah hope you enjoyed that next week i may have something else to show you and i will see but yeah that's another thing i want to focus on with this channel is like cool tools and whatnot things that i come across um i'm sure there'll be many different entries from supreme hand tools as well so yeah there's the household two set from Wera. I'll put the link in the descriptions or pin it to the top of the comments if anyone wants it. It's a really cool set. I really like it. It looks nice. It's got everything you would want in it. So yeah, I'm pretty impressed and quite a reasonable price for what you get. So yeah, let's try and introduce some more tools and whatnot into the channel, which will be fun. And I want to do some business stuff as well, eventually, um, maybe during the summer when works a bit quieter and we've got a little bit more time on our hands and we can pick up that side of things so yeah don't forget to subscribe thanks for watching hope you enjoyed it it was fun to make especially that one with a filter and everything i like that and yeah again let me know in the comments if you're going to install her when come shout me if you see me and yeah keep the questions coming <laughs>